Good evening, Barangay La Filnez. It's Friday, May 27, day 27. First Timothy, chapter 2, verse 8. Therefore, I want the men forever to pray, lifting up holy hands without anger or disputing. Scripture insights. Have you ever felt anger and bitterness toward God, a person or a circumstance? There is a potential for those experiences to grip our hearts and hold us negatively captive in our relationships. Jesus came to give us freedom from sin, death, and anything that enslaves us. As Paul is writing in, his, in this verse, he says, Our prayers should not be limited by location or expression and should be without anger or dispute. He describes a freedom in prayer that comes from the inward condition of the heart. Holy hands are lifted from a holy heart, which is surrendered, molded, and transformed by the Holy Spirit. What a joy it is to lift holy hands in praise to God in prayer, celebrating His goodness and love. There will be pain, disappointment, and difficulties in our lives. But Jesus has promised release and healing through the holiness of God. Has there been brokenness in your life recently that needs God's healing or mending? Lift up holy hands, pray, and experience real freedom. Today's prayer, Our Father, thank you for helping us to pray with holy hearts and hands. Please keep our minds and hearts in the center of your will and in the power of your presence. Prayer journal reflections. What is the Holy Spirit saying to you today about the Lord's protection, direction, and revelation for your life and the life of the Lafilness Church? Our devotion for tonight is written by Kevin Donnelly, District Superintendent, Wisconsin. Thank you, Barangay Lafilness. God bless you. See you tomorrow. Bye.